happy, you will see this on Monday. So happy Monday, hope everyone's having a great Monday today. This weekend, there just hasn't been a whole lot to vlog. Unfortunately, the kids, they've just, they've been in a mood where they need dad versus vlogger dad. And it sparks something I wanna talk about today in the vlog, which is just because you're prioritizing something doesn't mean you're failing. Let's get to it. The goal with daily vlogging is simply this, like you wanna upload and, and create some kind of creation every single day, put it up on the internet, and there, you, you have this body of work all of a sudden with all these different daily vlogs. Sometimes, as we all know, life gets in the way. There's a ton of stuff happening with the kids and school and Maureen's work, my work, all these different things. And sometimes that prohibits me from being able to do some of the videos that I want to do. But not only the videos I want to do, but sometimes some of the projects I want to do, just in general, not even with the vlog, just things in life that I want to accomplish. Sometimes I have to put them to the side and prioritize the family, my health, different things. One thing I've always said on this vlog is my priority list is like this. It goes family, health, work, and then the vlog. And this weekend my family needed me and I'm never going to be somebody that exploits my kids if they're having a bad day or if they feel something. Like I want them to be able to freely show their emotions but I never want to exploit that on my vlog. So what you see of my kids on the blog is the days where they wanna be in the blog. They, they're they happy, they love it, and, and that is most days. But there are those days where they're frustrated or they, they're sad or something's going on and you need to talk about it. I'm not gonna put that on the blog. That's where priorities come into play. Like, I, I don't think, I don't look at that, like if I can't vlog that, and I don't have this crazy, awesome, interesting vlog for the day. I don't look at that as a failure. I look at it as just prioritizing. Too many times we get caught up in things like that and we think that we're failing and it just kind of adds to this pressure on ourselves. We got to get over that. We got to get rid of that. And I'm mainly talking to myself right now. I'll give you another example. This wall back here, for example, this corrugated metal. I really have this vision and want to do this cool setup back here, but on the other hand, it just hasn't, I haven't had the time, the opportunity, and I, I haven't been able to do it the way I want to do it, but I will do it. I will get to it. That doesn't mean I have failed. <laughs> this isn't a failure in my opinion yet. It's just, it's a test that's not completed quite yet. It's not a failure, it's just other things, more important things have taken priority over it. And rightfully so, that's how it should be. And when you're daily vlogging, when you're a vlogger in general, you have to set those priorities. If you have those priorities in place, you always have something to fall back on. You can always look and say, okay, which category does this fall into right now? They need me, family needs me, I gotta kinda shove this to the side. This weekend I've been kinda on myself because I'm doing a lot of these talking vlogs where I'm just talking to the camera versus out and about and running around and doing all these things. And it's just, it hasn't been in the cards this weekend. But I'm not gonna chalk that up to a, a failure. It's just, I've had other priorities that I need to take care of with work stuff. I've been swamped at work, been swamped with family stuff. We're getting ready for a trip, like I've been saying. There's just all these other factors that have come into play where I've had to actually take those priorities, take action on them, and then the vlog, when I get to that point in my day where I can actually do a vlog like this, I, all of, this is what I've had. I've been able to just kinda reflect on things and do a talking point vlog. I still wanna make it a priority to get a video up every day. I think having a video up every day is just, for me, it's good. It keeps my wheels turning, it keeps me fresh, it keeps me just kind of creative and vibrant and all those different things like it, it's good for me mentally it's not the burnout or anything like that it just really kind of grounds me and makes me think and and make decisions and act and do different things because i want to get the vlog up and i want to do it every single day when it comes to things like that just start forgiving yourself like if you're sitting on a couch and doing nothing at all that's one thing, that's kind of a failure. <laughs> that's, that's you not taking action on anything at all. But if you're taking action on a bunch of different things and putting something to the side that you really wanna do, you wanna accomplish it, but I can't do it right now because I've gotta prioritize this stuff, that's not a failure. Don't consider that a failure. Just 
it, it's not the moment. It, it'll happen, but it's just not the moment that you can accomplish it. The failure side of it only comes if you take zero action at all and you're just playing on the sidelines and you let work go, you let your vlog go or whatever it is, whatever your passion is, you're just thinking about it all the time and taking no action, then that's kind of a failure. But if you're taking action on your priorities and just maybe not getting to the tasks that you want to get to, that is not a failure at all. Let me know your thoughts in the comments as always. I love reading your comments. Speaking of priorities, I got to get some work stuff done so that I'm all set up for Monday and it just makes my week. Anytime you can start your week off just fresh and ready to go, it's just, it's so much better. The week just turns out better anyway. I'm gonna go get that stuff done and I'll see you tomorrow.